Y'all may as well tag Cardi B because I'm finna give it to her like she thinks she give it up. And before y'all start, no, she came and found my tweet after all the tweets that I was tweeting to praise her and chose that one. And she should have stood on it. Now, don't delete nothing because I'm just now seeing it and I just woke up and it hit the blogs. Yeah, you caught red hand all that backbiting you thought you was going behind your button and clearing him for. You doing the same thing. Don't throw no rock and hide your hand, Miss Mamas. It ain't a it could ever make me feel bad about my body. You done touched everything on you. And you still got so many insecurities because you can't keep your husband at home. You the pay to get beat up because they want to suck the sick you sucking. That's not a me problem. That's a you problem. It could be four stomachs. It could be six stomachs. It could be seven stomachs. At the end of the day, you to sat there and paid for everything on you. And you still insecure. You still cannot keep yourself in the media selling sex and the sex ain't going nowhere it don't matter how much of a bad think you are with them horse titties at the end of the day what was said about you is correct you're sitting around trying to make sure you keep your family intact intact and your ass is still over here cussing out fans delusional fans when you're getting passed up by every single body around you you call yourself this bad rapper and you in this terrible 60 deal with atlantic when you need to be sitting around worried about how you gonna make sure these tracks and stay because even your peers are passing you up it's no reason why megan the stallions is on tour right now came out behind you and you done did a number one album and y'all didn't even put out a actual single that stays on the charts longer than two weeks so yeah what i said was correct and if it hit a nerve that's too fucking bad maybe you need to get in the booth and maybe you need to figure out how to get some records that are actually going to stay on the charts and stop cussing out these fans who are kids that like you acting like you so for your fans and y'all in a good relationship when you act real homophobic when you sat there and told them boys he was a fag he was a sissy you got bigger fish to fry and it ain't me so the next time you feel like you want to come for me first of all you better stand on what you said you better stand on what you said that's gonna give it to you how black you want to pretend you are i'm really that don't nobody look at me and question it i don't care about your accomplishment because next time you want to say something out your mouth i'm gonna be right here to give it right back to you